John Abbs, my friend, why do you mope? Um, the Continental Congress will never declare independence from England. You don't say. It'll take a miracle. Well, I don't know about a miracle, but uh, I think I've written something that might do the trick. I call it the Declaration of Independence. We've had enough of England. We object on decent grounds. Let's write the King of England, tell him where to put his crown. Goodbye, monarchy. Hello, democracy. It's not that we're ungrateful, but it's time for you to go. Goodbye, occupants. Hello, Mr. President. We've tried for a while to take it with style, but our anger's starting to show. Well, it started with the taxes, breaking our backs. You taxed our tea, so we threw it in the sea. You took our leaders far away. Didn't like the views, so you made them pay. Give you cash, but it ain't well spent. You rob us blind, but you won't represent. All this time, you wouldn't even defend us, so now we're declaring independence. <laughs> He ignored the laws that he himself made. He broke every silly. promise, we ruined our strange. commerce. The reason for our schism is We're mercantilism. Our loyalty our cracked when he the passed the stamp lame. act. We knew it for where if he used those the tariffs. He kidnapped, kidnapped our brothers, brothers, our children and wives. He burnt our towns. He ruined our lives. <laughs> Hello, democracy. We packed your bags. Get going. Don't hit your butt on the door. Goodbye, Earl T. Hello, sweet liberty. This just won't work. We think the king is a jerk, so tell him we're going to war. We the people declare that it's just not fair, so now we're going to war. Well, I don't know if that was a miracle, but it sure was catchy. Let's show this to the Congress. I think we got us some independence. <laughs>